All eyes are on Vernon Reed, the vice president of fixed income at T. Rowe Price. He's talking to students at Blueford Drew Jemison STEM Academy in West Baltimore. Reed grew up in the inner city. He knows the dangers and temptations students face. His brother fell victim to the streets and became addicted to drugs. He told a story of hard work, perseverance, and education, things that will help students rise to the top. Even though their circumstances may not be the best in the world, let me look at the demo demography in this area. I grew up in this area. I was lucky enough to, as I said earlier, have people to help me. I did well. I graduated from high school, went to college, got an MBA, got a nice job. I think all these kids need is opportunity, direction. They could do the same as I did. Vernon Reed kicked off the Affinity Circle Pathways to Leadership Speaker Series. The goal is to inform, inspire, and empower scholars. Educators are inviting corporate executives, government officials, and community leaders to share their journey to success, wisdom, and insight. You have a diverse number of students here many varied backgrounds and often they don't have an opportunity to see successful role models. Students enjoyed the speech and picked up some valuable information. He was good. I learned um, how his life was and you can take stuff from people speaking and you can try to um, do a little bit better. He was a great speaker. Like He really talked about how his brother was one and went to Harvard and became a lawyer and the other did bad because the streets are telling more. Reed is not just a speaker. He donated $25,000 to the pre-engineering lab. Blueford Drew Jemison STEM Academy focuses on science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. And with so much encouragement and positivity, students say it motivates them to stay out of trouble and strive for success. I just go in the house, do my homework. I, really, I rarely go outside, but, you know, I try to stay on the right path, go to school, come back. Don't try to stop, you know, just keep it moving. And hopefully keep moving to the top. Cherie Johnson, ABC2 News.